how's it going everybody? It's me, Scudog. Thank you very much for joining us. As you can see, we're back. We're on the unreliable and we've figured out how to put our weapon away. Look at that. Just hold X. Uh, and we're about to go. Let's uh, let's get out of here. We need to find a power regulator. Say, this wouldn't happen to be your ship, would it? Because you sure walked in it like it was your ship. And if this ship is yours, well, mister, you owe Spacer's Choice a hefty fine. I'm afraid we gotta dock your pay. Uh, I don't have a job, really, after I patched up your friend. Lie. You got it wrong. I'm a Starship Safety Inspector. Oh, by the law. I'm so sorry. I had no nice. idea we had an inspector coming. Nice. If you'd like to speak with my manager, I report to Constable Reyes in Edgewater. Edgewater's not too far. Just follow the road east of here, over past the cemetery. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to inspect the crime scene before I make my report. You do that. Um, take care. Okay. So where are we going? We're heading this way. We could explore. I think we'll... I think we'll, we'll make a beeline towards the, uh... What the heck? No, I'm going to make a beeline. We don't do it very often. I'm going to make a beeline towards where we're going. Look at that. Look at that place. I assume that's where we're going. Looks pretty cool. Oh, okay. Okay. I forgot we've got like the VATS thing. Time T T T T D. No T D D. Oh whoops. Oh you're not dead. Don't you be shooting me. Oh, that could have gone better. What the heck is happening here? I'm not sure what's going on. But it looks cool. Okay. Where did the enemies go? They all disappeared. Oh, over here. He turned to like a, a powder. What the heck? It's going to make it harder to find the loot. Oh god. Look how this one died. Nice. Oh no, the dead residents out here. Let's come back. Okay. Interesting that just so by pressing X does bring out your yeah, sorry, right trigger, it does bring out your thing. Um I don't know why the gun came out. Oh I see. Why is change weapon? If I press that, I get out my la the the next weapon in the in the list, I see. Okay, we're still heading to town. We're just gonna we're just gonna crack on, I think. Look at this, this looks nice. I like this. Okay. I mean this place looks like it's seen better days. I will say that. Whoa, hey. Where'd you come from? Oh hello. Don't go ambling out in those hills. That's marauder territory, friend. Um, my crash, my pod crashed in the hills back there. Your pod? What are you on about? You take a bruise to the cranium? Ain't safe out here. You'd best head into town. Avail yourself of Edgewater's high walls and low, low prices. Okay. Um, I never got your name. I'm Scott Dog. Pleased to make your acquaintanceship. I'd shake your hand, but I've been hauling corpses. You don't want none of that on you. Name's Silas. Junior in humor for the town of Edgewater. We're all part of the Spacer's Choice family. Okay. Um. This place looks like it's falling to pieces. Uh, heard a lot of new workers say that. First time they set eyes on Edgewater, they'll say, well, I can't work here. I don't belong here. Well, we do belong here. The Spacer's Choice family takes care of us from the cradle to the grave. As long as we provide our own cradles. 
Uh, who do I talk about? There was something else I wanted to ask. Who do I talk to about power regulator? Definitely not the junior in humor. I mean, that makes sense. If you've got business inquiries, you should stop by Reed Thompson's office. He's up in the tower above the cannery. Head into town, follow the road. Look, you obviously ain't a worker. What's your racket? You a smuggler? Freelancer? Um, okay. Uh, depends on the work. You're offering me a job. Edgewater is a company town, board owned and operated. That includes the cemetery. None of us own our gravesites. We rent them from the company. Renting means money. Money means paperwork. Paperwork means signatures. Some of our families become a mite delinquent in paying their dues, you see. You want me to collect what's owed? I can do that. You're making people pay for their own graves. Company policy. If it was up to me, I'd put the whole town ten feet under. Free of charge. Um, why can't you collect them yourself? Quotas, mostly. Got a backlog of graves to fill. Bodies won't Why are so many people yeah. dead here? Uh, all right, we'll collect them. Four workers still haven't paid up. Phyllis, Conrad, Ludwig, and Martin Abernathy. He's a special case. You may want to twist his arm a little. Uh, why is he a special case? He just is. Look, I don't want to get into it. Just make sure he pays up. I'm on it, all right. Uh, where can I find these people? Conrad's got a barbershop in town. Phyllis works at the cannery most hours. Abernathy... I ain't seen him in a few days. His domicile is near the cannery. You'll find him in town. All except Ludwig, that is. He's over by the landing pad. Okay. Uh, there was something else I wanted yeah. to ask you. Is there? I don't know if there was. Uh, you lose a lot of people to marauders. Former people, yeah. Marauders been raiding my graves, you see. Hence the armed guards. Uh, what are they after? Loot? Oh no. They are after the most precious loot of all. Spacer's Choice Company property. If those marauders swipe any more bodies out of my cemetery, the company's gonna duck my pay. Why is everyone so Spacer's Choice around here? Uh, if the marauders swipe any more bodies, uh, yeah, okay, this town must be in pretty bad shape if, they, if it's keeping you employed. How long have you been a junior in humor? Hang on, I'm doing some math in my head. Uh, 20, 30, carry the one. Uh, all my life, work's been real good to me. Fresh air, exercise. Only problem is the paperwork. Can't get anybody to pay their gravesite fees. Uh, okay, this town must be pretty bad shape. If it's, that seems a bit harsh, right? Let's get going. I could really go for some salt, you know. Okay. Beats working at the cannery. I hear ya. Okay, let's keep going. What's this place? Cemetery, okay. Do you want to end your years in luxury and comfort? Do you dream of walking beneath the vaulted arches of Byzantium? Uh, early retirement is finally here. Early retirement is your ticket to Byzantium. Early retirement, Chairman Rockwell and Minister Clark's gift to you. Selection for early retirement process is by lottery. Winners enjoy an all-expenses-paid trip to a new life in Byzantium, uh, the jewel of the Halcyon. Halcyon? 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 Right, um, use terminal, it is locked, right, no? Okay, messages. The subscription the Humans Association newsletters are expired, we'd like to invite you to renew your subscription, now you for a copy of our newest publication. Okay. Uh, Edgewater Cemetery is a, pro is a property of the Space Choice Company, the Space's Choice family takes care of its own, we go to the great growth sites. Uh, plots and headstones are available. My space of choice is affordable. Okay. Anything else? I think no inventory logs. I'm going to hack this burial invoice. Theodore Granger. Industrial accident. Paid and accounted. Teddy's course was missing a hand. Deducted five bits from graveside fee because I'm a kindly fellow. Okay. We hear you. 
we could steal stuff i don't know if i want to steal stuff i'm not sure we would just walk in and steal stuff but we would walk in and steal these because we need these so we could take this riot control helmet i maybe would we'd only steal stuff um we'd only steal stuff that we would we would use right you know we're we're, we're a nice thief okay we're gonna just end up stealing stuff let's do it Okay, this looks this looks nice. Look at this. Look at this place. I mean, it doesn't look nice, nice, but it looks nice, right? A little bit of a little bit of frame rate issue when we spin round. I like that. Hello. They start asking you for some medicine. Come tell me. I'll set them straight. Can we go in these places? No. Keep your distance, friend. Sick house is no place for a traveler. What the heck? Yeah, let's not go in there. We don't want to go in there. It's for the sick people. Ah, the barber shop. We know we need to. We know we need to go in there. Hello. Please don't touch anything. Your hands are probably crawling with germs. Physical hygiene recapitulates moral hygiene. Cleanliness is next to lawfulness. I mean, all of that is maybe true. Uh, relax, I'm clean. So everyone says, until someone forgets to cough into their elbow and then we're all dying of plague. Yeah, a little closer to the I'm Conrad. You will report to me if your hair fails to meet Spacer's Choice aesthetic standards. You will also report to me in the event of your death, whereupon I will clean and prepare your remains for interment. Nice. Uh... Burial. In the unfortunate event of a fatality. It's what a barber does. We make you presentable. Is it? Um, speaking of burial, Silas made me to collect your fees. Ah, gravesite fees. Silas and I had talked about this at length. I thought I'd made it clear my pecuniary situation precludes the necessary restitutions. Uh, you mean you're broke? As broke as pie crust, friend. Bitless, indigent, destitute. I simply cannot afford it. I am a blemish on the prosperity of our fair settlement. When I expire, I expect Silas to toss my body into a ditch. Uh, I don't care. Pay up. Yeah, we'll tell him he was acting. Thank you, no. I despise the cereals. Tell Silas I can't afford to pay. And that I fully expect to have my medical rights revoked for this dereliction. With my apologies. Okay. Hang on, medical rights? Some time ago, I fell ill with the plague. By the grace of the law, and through my own hard work, I'd proven worthy of treatment. Frankly, I don't imagine I'll earn that right a second time. The barber work hasn't been profitable, you see. I've had to keep this old place running with my own savings. Um, just give si Silas an IOU. Not a bad idea. But I'd need some kind of collateral. My pair of lucky clippers. No, that won't do. Your idea intrigues me, but I'm afraid I don't have anything to give Silas. I'm open to suggestions. Um... I'll let you know if I think of something. Much okay. We'll be back, comrade. You cheapskate. Okay, let's get going. A resident and a resident. Nothing inside the walls today. Nothing for us outside those walls. You ought to know that. Staying long? Hmm? Hmm. Okay. Um, we've been in the barber shop. The cannery is that way. I guess we go in here, right?
Nice. Hello. Latest report? Only the part that said we ain't making our quotas. If only McDevitt's folk hadn't abandoned us, Cannery could use those extra hands. I don't know you. Uh, I'm Scott. Oh, hold on. Uh huh. The unreliable, you say? Never heard of any company supply ship with that particular name. I don't know what you're about, but this here is a Spacer's Choice drinking establishment. We're all loyal, hardworking company folk here. Uh, so you're not going to serve me a drink? Uh, something going on here that I should know about. <laughs> Am I that easy to read? Yeah, we've been having some problems lately. Loyalty issues, lines in the sand. I know where folk in Edgewater stand. But you, I don't know you. If you're going to have a drink, I'd like to ask that you do it within the premises. <sighs> Can't have you taking drinks over to those deserters. Uh, what's this about deserters? Traitors. The lot of them. Bunch of folks decided they were tired of working and went out into the wilds to fend for their own selves. Town's already struggling to make quotas, even without that band of slackwits abandoning their posts. Bunch of lazy, shiftless rung leeches. Anyway, enough about them. What can I do for you? Well, I mean, I guess we'll have a drink, right? Um... I'd like to talk to Reed. Where can I find him? Coming right up. A merchant skill. Your merchant skill is equal to the value of your best dialogue skill and you use negative and used to negotiate a price when buying and selling from vendors. Okay. Uh, so we could buy some of these things, right? Uh, 40 credits. We've got 59. Uh, this gives us a plus one to our personality. Minus one to dexterity, perception, and charm. Ouch. When the, okay, we could just have some water. We don't really need any of these. Let's, uh, let's sell our junk. Nice. Okay. Uh, oh, I almost forgot. I'm contractually obligated to recite company slogans to any visitors. <laughs> you tried the best, now try the rest. Spacer's That's a choice. rubbish slogan. Uh, where can I talk to Reed? Do you now? And what makes you think Mr. Thompson wants to talk to you? He's a busy man. You want to talk to Mr. Thompson, try ignoring your duties. He'll summon you up to that great big tower atop the cannery, and you'll get yourself a proper dressing down. Oh, he's going to want to speak to me. Um... It is a good thing. If you're not pulling your weight, you don't deserve to live here. Simple as that. I mean, everyone is towing the company line, right? Uh, is there anything Go else? Ahead. Amelia. Um, so what's your story? I don't see how that's any of your business. Oh, come on. I'm just trying to be friendly. Yeah, we can't. I need to be rude. And there's no need for you to pry either. Yeah, good point. <laughs> uh, okay, we'll leave that. We'll keep the, the flying through space thing to ourselves. What's through here? The restroom. Okay. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing in the restroom. Uh, this is locked. Interesting. We can't open it. We almost can open it. Okay. We don't want to steal any of this stuff. Is there anyone else in here that we want to talk to? Sorry, I've got a lot to do. Okay, I don't think you look different. No, you're just wearing a green suit. Okay. So I guess we're heading this way. I get the feeling we're going to run into these people, right? I've been feeling pretty low these days. Don't let the boss catch us. paper that. inside the wall. What's this? The constable. Hello. Welcome to the Spacer's Choice Constabulary. Hi. We are Halcyon's leading brand in Frontier Justice. The office is writing up promotion. Purchase three criminal investigations and the fourth one's free. Um, if you need help with your Marauder problem, I'm for hire. 
As a Spacer's Choice Constable, I am authorized to grant you legal authority toward apprehending wanted criminals. Know how to carry yourself in a fight? I've got bounties out for these three marauders. Cross them off and bring me their fingers. Just one per marauder, please. I'll dust off the old fingerprint roller. Okay, so the people we saw are outside, all right. Uh, I've got some questions for you, if you don't as mind. As long as your questions fall within the acceptable margins of curiosity. Okay. Uh, does the name Phineas Wells mean anything to you? His likeness decorates many a wanted poster. Do you have any relevant information about this individual? No, no. You are correct. An outstanding bounty has been posted for information pertaining to the whereabouts of Phineas B. Wells. Um. Unfortunately, the arrest of Mr. Wells falls outside my authority. I, I wonder if he's hearing this. Choice in the region of I Edmund wonder if he's hearing this. Wells is wanted by the board. If you have information related to the location of Phineas B. Wells, you are required to submit that information to your nearest board authority. Okay, I hear you. Um, it's one Something other thing. To uh, yeah, goodbye. <laughs> Good talk. There's no one in the cells, okay. Pretty quiet around here, okay. Wish we had some better rations. At least you got your help. Okay, uh, where else are we going? What was this building? Hello. Yes, Mr. Thompson. I'm fine, Mr. Thompson. Never been healthier. Hi. Well, uh, did, uh, did Mr. Thompson send you? He did not. Well, you tell Mr. Thompson I'll be right at my post tomorrow. Uh, bright and early tomorrow. Because I'm definitely not plagued. As spry as a spring chicken. <laughs> That's old Abernathy. Uh -oh. You want to tell me what's got you so nervous? You some sort of wandering alienist? Yep, that's Walking me. Walking into a man's own domicile, pestering him about his <laughs> mental state? <laughs> yep, that's definitely me. So you're... I'm here to collect your graveside fees. You don't know that. I could have been saying anything. Maybe I said vague. You know how words sound a mite strange when you're sick. I'm not Wait, sick. Wait, no. Oh, Good. Damn it. Okay, listen. Maybe I am feeling a little under the weather, but I swear I'm on the mend. Please, don't tell the constable. Well, I think we've got the leverage we need here, right? She'll toss me in the sick house. I would have confessed before the good vicar... Get some ablutions for my spirit. Just never found my courage is all. Hey, you're hale and healthy and possibly for hire, ain't ya? Uh, do a good turn for an expiring old man. Um, how can I help? There's a cache of anthracillin tucked away in the old community center. Powerful stuff. Stronger than what we got, anyway. I need you to break in. Nab that medicine and bring it back to me. I mean, that seems like a lot. I'll do what I can. I literally only just got here. You will not find any guards within sight of that old place. Marauders, on the other hand. What can you tell me about marauders? I have it on good authority. There's a gang of them squatting there. I advise stepping softly. Why can't you buy some medicine? I tried medicating myself with Adrena time. Didn't do much for me, as far as I can tell. Anyway, I can't just buy medicine. Distribution of medicine is strictly prohibited to any workers beneath the acceptable margin of health. Company policy. And otherwise, the company won't treat you. Uh, come and have a. You don't look a day over 90. I tell myself the same thing every morning. You've seen those young workers at the cannery. 
What with their unbent spines and pristine knee joints? I can't compete with that. Okay, I've heard enough. So you'll do it then? I have genuinely have no idea. I'll have a think about it. I need to. You want to mingle? Go try the. No, canteen. I want your money for the thing. Silas knows, doesn't he? That's why he sent you. That's why he wants me to pay up. He knows. Look, I got my gravesite fees right here. See, I'm good for my word. Get me that medicine, and I'll see to your payment. Okay, we'll we'll bear it in mind. Don't know how I feel about it. You're making a mistake working for Abernathy. Oh, hello. Excuse me. I'm Esther Blaine, Spacer's Choice Actuary. I overheard your talk with Abernathy. I hope you're not thinking about getting him that medicine. Abernathy is a well-known hypochondriac. Anthracillin is wasted on him. You're better off selling it to me instead. Okay. Uh, he's got symptoms. I probably shouldn't tell you. Don't want you implicated for what I'm trying to do. Well, that is not a good enough reason. All right. Here's a summary. A lot of sick people in this town, and we don't have the medicine to treat them all. Can't reach out to corporate without crossing a river of red tape, so I'm reaching out to you. Hmm. I'm paid better than Abernathy. Whatever he's giving you, I will do you one better. That's all I can ask of you. What the heck with dilemmas? I don't like it. Just ask yourself, what would Scott Dog do? That's the question here, right? Don't have to worry too much about it. Just what would Scott Dog do? Died a couple weeks back. Could we go in and just tell them Abernathy is sick? I'm intrigued. Interesting jumpsuit you've got. Thanks very much. And by interesting, I mean suspiciously reminiscent of contraband. Nope, definitely not that. Um, no, it doesn't look like we can. I wondered if we could come in and say, Abernathy's ill, go sort him out, but... I'm not saying I would do that, I'm just saying, could we do that? What's this place? No one's in here. Okay, so we've got the work bench thingy over here. We don't need to worry about any of these things, right? I could break you down. Okay. Trouble ticket. Turn on engine, try it again, try it again. Kick the loader. Uh, okay, good. Main cannery production line at heat processing. Schedule 5, S46701A, observe processing of cans, follow the first batch to heat processing stage. <laughs> okay, good. Um, reset to low by executive level admin. Okay. Okay. I don't think there's anything else in here that we're... Oh, hold on. Hold on. We'll take that with us. I take it all back. There is something here. Where the heck are we? Yes. I guess we'll help ourselves to some of these things, right? Criminal activities, trespassing, lockpicking, hacking, and murder are all considered legal activities frowned upon by society. After being seen, if you want to engage with those activities, uh, sorry, avoid being seen. Okay, hopefully we weren't seen. No one's here. Don't know if that was a good one to lockpick or not, but. Yeah, 
that takes us back outside. Where the hell are we? I mean, we'll just help herself to some of this stuff, right? I'm assuming it would tell us if we were stealing, right? Um, Edgewater Star Town and Cannery, Maintenance Division. Enter a keyword. Open last search. We've been re to Terra One. I kissed her goodbye at the platform and asked if I'd ever see her again. And we both knew the answer was no. Look up and think of me. So I will look up and think of you. Uh, Robert, they wouldn't let me keep her. But you know I will raise her with love. Uh, perhaps more than I would make time for. You're a patient and present in a way that I am not. Company says she has no name until you give her one. Her birthday will be set on this date. She is legally delivered to you. She was actually born on 7 July. Make her feel special when I can't. What? Uh, I'm going to be this time. Okay. Okay. What else we got? Armor parts, nice. Okay, um, I guess we just keep going. I feel a bit, feel a bit wrong having a snoop around here. I have to say, um, who's? I wonder where I am. More bypass shunts bathroom. Oh, look at this nice little shower. Okay, now we're up on this nice little terrace, which does look quite nice. Okay, so I genuinely have no idea where I was. I'm a little intrigued by this. This first one. Open last search. patient and present in a way that I am not. The company says she has no name until you give her one. Her name is Paravati. They tell me her birthday, sorry, they tell me her birthday will be set to the date she's legally delivered to you. She was actually born on July 7th. Make her feel special. Is there a date or anything with this? I don't understand. Okay, I feel like that, I don't know why, but I feel like that's relevant. But who knows? It just, it feels like a weird thing. And it's worded very weirdly, right? Hey, you hear about Wilson? Heard marauders got in. Just between us, Wilson deserted. Lost his nerve. Ran off in a second night. Okay, we could open there, but it looks like we've got to go this way, so. Okay, let's head in here. Wow, we can just walk into the factory floor? Seems a bit... Seems a bit weird. Should we have a little look around? I've discovered a vending machine. I don't know where. Over here. What do you vend? Vending machines offer a variety of items to purchase, mostly from one company. Hack skill of 20 or higher allows you to sell items to the vending machine. Strict items on a vending can only be purchased when you have a high enough reputation. Okay. So we can sell stuff. I don't know if I need to sell stuff. And we can buy some stuff. Oh look, we got some armor here. Look, nice. Elite troop, uh, troop, troop armor. Not troop armors. 
Okay. Is this a different one? No, this is a broken one. Okay. Hello. I don't feel like I'm meant to be here. One left severed hand. Just gotta keep our head. I agree. Okay, so we can steal stuff from these, but I genuinely don't know what I'm doing here. I'm just wandering around this place. There's a way down. Okay, I think we need to go back to the main. Sorry, sorry, dude. Let's go back to the main door, right? This must take us back to where we came in. Okay. Edward Sultana, uh, Sultuna Canning Factory strictly adheres to the space's choice. Schedule is sick leave. Be considerate towards other members. Uh, two to four works to process and prove your sick leave. Lost hours must be compensated for the company. Remember, work invigorates the spirit. Yeah, I, I debate that. All right, let's get going. Up we go. Nice. I like it. monkey argo i'm sorry mr thompson sir you asked why it's taking so long to fix the answer's technical don't apologize just try using small words for me the cans bust open in the oven because she's set to cook saltuna which isn't what we've got mr thompson i think there's someone here to see you focus miss holcomb you and i are still talking let's start over Walk me through the process. Show me where it's going awry. Well, sure. It's uh, mostly on account of what we're feeding into the mechanism. It puts food in cans. We have food, we have cans. Why won't it work like we need? She's expecting Seltuna of a certain size. We're filling the cans with... Well, not fish. Okay, um, well, there we go. I think we put a cut in here. We'll be back speaking to Tobson um, and, and finding out, I guess, a bit more about Saltuna. I hope you're enjoying this. Uh, I'm intrigued. Oh, wow, look at this. Oh, this will be interesting. We're going to spin through the water. Oh, no, okay. Uh, we'll uh, look at our shiny weapon. Um, we'll put a cut in here. We'll be back. I'm enjoying this. Uh, hopefully, we'll find out what is going on in, in Edgewater fairly soon. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe button, follow us on Twitter. Scott of Gaming. We'll see you again soon. Thank you.